Okay, we are off. We are going to on a road trip. Where am I going? Um, to look at the Silo Art Silo Art Trail in Victoria. Let's go. The Silo Art Trail is Australia's largest outdoor gallery. The trail stretches over 200 kilometres, linking Brim with neighbouring towns Lascelles, Patchy Wallach, Rosebury, Rappanyup and Sheeps Hill. Providing an insight into the true spirit of the Wimmera Mallee, the trail recognises and celebrates the region's people through a series of large-scale mural portraits painted onto grain silos, many of which date back to the 1930s. The project saw a team of renowned artists from Australia and across the world visit the region, meet the locals and transform each grain silo into an epic work of art, each one telling a unique story about the host town. If you're starting from Melbourne, it's about a three and a half hour drive, about 300 kilometres. Our first stop was the silos in Brim. So the Brim silo was the first silo completed in 2016 by Guido Van Helton and it is fantastic. Just a few kilometers down the road and you come to the town of Rosebury, a tiny little town, and it's this art silo work that was completed in late 2017 by artist Caffeines. Her artwork depicts themes that she says embody the region's past, present and future. Our next silo is in Patchewalook. Brisbane artist Fintan Maggie booked a room at the local pub to immerse himself in the community and get to know its people. When he met local sheep farmer and grain farmer Nick Noodle Holland, Maggie knew he'd found his muse. In order to capture the true essence of LaSalle's Melbourne-based artist Roan knew that he had to learn about the town from those who were deeply connected to it. Here he depicts local farming couple Jeff and Merlin Horman, part of the family that has lived and farmed in the area for four generations. Onto the tiny little town of Sheep Hills. This was my favourite mural. Throughout his career, Melbourne based artist Adnate has used his work to tell the stories of Indigenous people and their native lands, particularly the stories of Aboriginal Australians. In 2016, Adnate developed a friendship with the Baringa Gudgeon Land Council in the northwest of Victoria and found his inspiration for this mural. This was truly a beautiful mural. We were here early in the morning. The sun was behind us and the colours were spectacular. On to our last silo now, which was in Rappanyup. Rappanyup's art silo is the work of Russian mural artist Julia 
Volchanova, who turned her attention to the town's youth and their great love of team sport. The work vividly captures the spirit of the community and provides an accurate insight into the rural youth culture. I highly recommend this road trip of the art silos. They were absolutely beautiful and suitable for all ages to see. Please check out our other video on where we stayed in between our road trip at Hope Town, a free campsite. Please subscribe and please give us a thumbs up and we'll catch you next time. Bye.